Hi kids, I've got a story for you today and I've got a few things beside me that I want to show you. The first two things I'm going to bring out is a couple of signs. If you can read them, you'll see this one says God. Now you'll see the next one also says God. If you look at them, you'll notice they're both the same, but they're also a little different. This one has a small g, and this one is a big G. Now, did you know that when you read your Bible, every time you see the word God with the big G, that refers to our God in heaven. If you see a word in the Bible that says God with a small g, that means it's referring to gods that people have made, different gods, fake gods. Now, what can be a fake god? Well, I know we know some of the stories in the Bible where people have had idols, even statues. I'm going to show you a picture of one. This is actually a Chinese god. I believe this one's name is Buddha, and this one's a golden statue, and people will actually pray to this. There's also some people that I know that actually pray to this. Let me show you this. This is an elephant. Can you believe that people pray to wooden elephants, stone elephants, paper elephants, elephants on pillows? Now let me ask you this. Do you think an elephant can actually answer a prayer? No, an elephant can't. So what we want you to remember is your God is a big G God. The gods that people make are a small g God. I wonder if I can get you to think of some other small g gods that you can have in your life. I've got one tucked right here. It's money. Did you know if you spend all your time trying to make money or spend money, so much time that you don't have time to talk to Jesus, you're making that a God. Do you know that even you kids, if you spend all your time with your toys and never have time for Jesus, your toys can become like a God. So remember, make time for Jesus every day. And you remember what it says in Exodus chapter 20 and verse 3. It says, you shall have no other gods before me. Remember, your God in heaven, he's the big G God. We'll see you next time.